Hey Taurus, welcome to Tourmaline Tarot. We're going to do your end of October touch-up read. Let's see what's going on here. For Taurus, end of October. Just a quick one. And if it's for you, you'll know. If it's not for you, you'll know. Because it is a general. So, you know. So what is going on for Taurus? I'm using the Pulp Tarot. One, two, give me one more good one. Taurus, what is happening for Taurus? Let's see. Okay, Taurus. I keep saying Taurus. So, King of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. Taurus, I feel like you are in your element, literally. It's Pentacles, it's Earth, it's you, it's all up in your business. So with this King of Pentacles, there could have been a mastery that you had with something. This Two of Pentacles is this juggling. The Queen of Pentacles, though, makes me feel like whatever you had to get control of and get balance of, you're able to kind of bring that out in a more nurturing way. This guy is kind of like boss business, mean and you know, not tough guy, but he's the one you also don't want to tussle with. Okay, you have the King of Wands on the bottom out of curiosity. King of Wands and Six of Cups. So, yeah, stuff from the past, um, you know, any kind of habits, you know, nostalgia kind of things that are from your past and how you were doing stuff. There could have been a revisiting of that um, and coming from a better place. Like, I feel like there was a recharge, a reboot for yourself. This King of Pentacles, what is that about? Eight of Pentacles, yeah. You had to pick one thing and work on it. You had to kind of take charge in that element. Because with the Two of Pentacles, the Page of Wands, you know, you were trying to put it back out there. I feel like this is more you deciding how things are going to go, what we're going to work on, how we're going to do it. This is kind of the execution phase of it. So Page of Wands, you could be getting Knight of Wands. Yeah, so now we're going to do it. You're communicating how we're going to do it. What are the expectations? What are we doing here with the Queen of Pentacles, though? I'm, it's the world. So I don't feel like this is, I think you're cool with whatever new phase is coming. But you're trying to package stuff up for other people so they get on board. The, and, I mean, stuff is not fully revealed. And that can be a hard sell when you're just like, no, 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 trust me believe me and people are like no i need like a, a diagram or something the moon what about it seven of cups because you're all about the execution but all the pieces might not be there yet but you're also more way more chill going into it because i do want to see what this eight of pentacles is about three of wands yeah so there could have been a patience element you're waiting for things to manifest like you're in the doing phase even if you don't have all the stuff, I feel like you're confident that it is going to happen here. Give me one more on the Seven of Cups. It's the Knight of Cups. I feel like you're just kind of undeterred in whatever pops up from here on out. So there was an old way of doing things. Now there's a you way of doing things. <laughs> Taurus, I like it. So, um, like I said, you might not have all the pieces, but with what you're coming to the table with, I think you'll be fine. You know, or if anyone's coming towards you, you kind of just have a clear, you know, not path because you have the moon and the seven of cups here. But it's it's like you have a very defined sense of self that if anyone does come in and try and offer you stuff or take you off your game or, you know, throw a monkey wrench in, you're like, whatever. So, yeah, Taurus, you, you're a little unshakable. I love it. Um, and actually, I feel like that might potentially could get noticed it's the knight of cups if anyone does come at you i feel like the intentions are positive it, there's there's like no shadiness going on we have the queen of cups page of swords three of swords okay i don't feel like this is you i feel like this page of swords though is like you know the spying aspect and i don't know you know how people are like the the best revenge is just living your best life it's almost like that so whoever this Queen of Cups is could be a water sign, but I just have a feeling there's someone that's been watching and isn't rooting for you to go down because you do have the Five of Swords on the bottom here, which is why I'm saying there's like a little bit of like a one-upsmanship thing. So if you've had anyone that was like 
jealous or like, why does Taurus get this? Or like, why is Taurus, you know, those kind of people, you know, and then you're over here like, I'm still cheering for you. I don't know what the problem is. I'm, I'm in competition with no one. So that's why I was saying there's like kind of this element of like someone, anything trying to monkey wrench you. You're like, that's nice. So with the three of swords, I feel like that's them. That's them getting their kind of like, ah, wah, wah. Taurus, you know, doesn't go out that easy. So moving on to the Oracle, you know, and like I said, other people's intentions, it's almost like it bounces off you. And the key is the ring and the heart. So that is you know, kind of entering in that new cycle, that world thing. The ring can also be about commitments. You could be committing to something that you really care about. This could be a relationships, work job. It doesn't all have to be about love, but there could be a love element. Like I said, with that Knight of Cups being like, yo, Taurus, what you doing? So yeah, the key is kind of just coming to it with a, I want to say honest heart, like just an intent. Your intent is good. Then you have the sun and the moon. Okay. Like both things. Anything that was confusing because you had the moon back here and this is more of a Norman style, but um, there will be recognition. There will be something that kind of gets shown to you where people are like, hey, Taurus, you got it going on. So Taurus, um, just keep being your bad self. And that's what we have for the rest of October. And I'll talk to you later.